it's hard because I think you're, especially in the beginning, you're going to hit a lot of failures. So I find that one of the hardest things that especially more junior engineers have is that they have lots and lots of ideas and then they go to talk to the product managers, they grab a coffee, they grab whatever else. And the product manager is going to sit there and they're going to list you 75 reasons why your idea sucks. That's just what they do. Like it's their job. And then you get really discouraged because you're like, oh my God, like I have these ideas, but they're not hearing me. I guess I shouldn't be talking to them. You have to develop a little bit of a thick skin and sort of take that feedback and keep iterating and iterating and just keep seeding those ideas and keep seeding those things. And over time, you'll begin to sort of chip away at that wall and begin to hear their feedback, begin to change how you tell the narrative of what you want to do. And you do have to take some time out of your day-to-day -day job. If you're just focusing, I'm going to be honest about this, you're 10 to 4 in those hours and you're like, I expect to do my main job and also be able to be strategic and thinking, it's not going to happen. You usually have to find a little bit of a window where you're doing a little bit of extra work where you're setting time aside to think about those strategic things, putting those proposals together, shopping them around, incorporating the feedback and repeating that many, many times over until you finally get something that lands and resonates and then you start building on top of that. But the hardest thing to overcome is that initial like, no, and that initial like, here's all the reasons why it's not going to work. Take that feedback, build on top of it, and iterate over and over and over again. By the time you get to like the 10th pitch, you'll be doing much better. If you enjoyed this clip, make sure you watch the entire video, which has a lot more content just like this. And if you want to make sure you don't miss any of our episodes where we talk to leaders in the tech industry, from software engineers to product managers to engineering managers, make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel and also click the notification bell. And that's all the time for this week. I'll catch you guys on the next episode.